Hi and welcome to another installment of Math Basics with Mr. Besh. Um, today's video comes from a request from an elementary school parent and they wanted to know is there an easy way that they could get their kids to remember their teen number times tables? Uh, I got bad news for you, no. <laughs> I know when I was in school um, we did our times tables up to like 12 and 13, some schools do them up to 10. Uh, other than memorization there's really no easy way to do that, however I do got a trick to help you with the teen multiplication um, and I'd like to show you this little trick now. I got three examples for you and here's the first one. Um, the trick is to take the teen value and break it into two separate values. One value will always be 10 and the other value will be what's left over. In this case, 14 breaks down into 10 and 4. And then what you do is you take the, the, the math of each of these terms and you add them together. So now what you have is you got 10 times 7, which makes 70, and then 4 times 7, which makes 28. And now you put these two terms together, and that gives you 98. I think this is a lot easier to do than just remembering that 14 times 7 is 98. Um, a second example, 15 times 9, doing it the same way. Take the 15 and break it down into 10 and 5. This way, I end up having 10 times 9, which makes 90, and 5 times 9, which makes 45, and together they put together to make 135. But then you might say, well, what happens if both numbers are teens, like my last example here? Well, you keep the first number exactly the way it is, and you break down the second number the same way we just did. So now the 12 breaks down into 10 and then 2. And then you take both of these terms the same way. 14 times 10 gives you 140. Remember, anytime you take a number times 10, you just simply add a 0 at the end. And then 14 times 2 will give you 28. And together they combine together to make 168. So hopefully this little trick here helps you out um, when you're doing your multiplying with the, uh, the T numbers. Um, like I said, it, it tends to be a little bit easier than trying to memorize the whole lot. And that's it. I hope you uh, found this both helpful and informative.